Hello, all you YouTubers, this is Wellington filming. I'm going to show you how to reset a Toshiba satellite Windows 7 operating system 64 bit back to its original factory state as if you've just got it out to, uh, of the box and set it up. First of all, check you've got the power lead plugged in and is switched on. Also, if you've got any data that uh, you don't want to lose off your computer, I suggest you get a, an external hard drive and back it up all on there. You will also need a cup of tea. Right, so I'm going to show you what to do. First of all, power it on. As it's powering on, get yourself to the F8 button and repeat, repeatedly press the F8 button while it's, while it's powering up then you'll see a screen with all the command prompts the one that's normally highlighted is repair your computer so go to the enter button and enter repair your computer you'll see that thing at the bottom there Like I say, this will reset it back to its factory settings and uh, clear up any viruses or any problems you've had, anything you can't get rid of and uh, also speed up your uh, computer. So now you'll see system recovery options. It'll also at the top, English United States. Uh, select a keyboard input method. That mine will be... United Kingdom and press next then it'll ask me for the username click on that um, Mars Mr. Blue and it'll ask me to enter my password And then press OK. Right, and you get system recovery options again. Top one will say start up repair, system restore to an earlier point, system image recovery, Windows Toshiba HD recovery at the bottom, recover the complete Windows operating system to its original state, so it's the bottom one you want. Then it will just give you uh, welcome, you may use this program to recover your operating system to its original installed factory state, you want to press OK. Now normally you would need to buy out, uh, the sheep make you buy uh, a recovery disk, but as you can see that's uh, just not necessary. Press next, and it's just uh, going on about this out and the other, which is useless. Next, H Toshiba HD recovery, if you choose yes, operating system will be recovered to the original installed factory state. Do not interrupt this process, make sure your power lead is switched on and it doesn't get switched off when you press yes. And now it starts doing its thing. As you can see, it's doing all its whatever it's doing. It's quite a simple process. This is don't need to take it into a shop or anything. Stand there pressing the zero button on the counter. Obviously when it's reset you'll need to do your Windows updates, etc, etc. And like I say, this is a Toshiba satellite. Uh, I've got the i5 processor, you also get the 3 and the 7 processor. Windows 7, 64-bit. Now the 
this is saying at the bottom here it's going to take about five minutes seven minutes unfortunately on the iPhone uh, 5 you can't pause the video it's a bit of a problem Like I say, once it's reset, you'll need to get all your uh, Windows updates, etc. etc. I mean, I don't think I need to sit here for seven minutes, but basically, once it's finished doing what it's doing. It's self-explanatory and uh, you just uh, set up your Wi-Fi etc. As I said, if it's, if it's in a switched off state, you switch it on. Whilst you're switching it on, keep pressing the F8 button repeatedly and follow the instructions for restoring it back to factory settings. Uh, basically that is it. It's still doing it. Five minutes fifty-seven seconds left. Like I say, I can't pause this. Pause this video. So it's self-explanatory once it's finished. And uh, feel free to leave comments. And uh, if you like the video, press like. Thanks for watching. Wellington filming out.